doing? Haven't seen you in a while. Hey, I'm doing pretty well. How's the family doing? Um, they're doing okay. Um, our oldest daughter, Mackenzie, she really needs um, wisdom teeth surgery. And she, her teeth just look so bad, and we want to really help her out, but the surgery is going to cost way too much money, and we just we can't afford it right now. How much is it going to cost? Um, the doctors say around 10000 Well, she definitely needs it. She looks like an antelope. Yeah, tell me about it. <laughs> well, listen, I do know somebody at the bank. They really? probably can help you out, yes. And the idea here is she takes money out of dormant accounts, and you only have to pay her a small fee, but she'll get you the $10,000. Wow, that's, that's amazing. I, I'd almost do anything to get this money. Can't tell anybody about this, though. It's totally confidential. Okay, all right. I won't. Perfect. My friend, Ben Teller. Hey, how are you doing? How are you doing? Good, how are you? Good. So what listen, for you? I have a friend. She needs ten thousand dollars. Her daughter needs surgery, life threatening. Yeah. Wisdom teeth. She looks awful. Um, so, All right. what can you do? What's the fee that you can give her? You think? I mean, what does she need to buy? ASAP, within the next week. I'm thinking maybe a thousand. A thousand? I think she'd be okay with that. She might be able to do that. All right. Do you want me to bring her in, send her over at some point? When's your next appointment open? Um, I'd say maybe like. Wednesday at 4.30, right before we close. Perfect. So hey, listen, I got in touch with the uh, bank teller. Yeah, she said uh, she has an appointment open 4.30, Wednesday, right before the bank closes. That'll work for you? Perfect, great. Transferring the money. Hi, I'm Peter Bartek. And you're probably wondering what the heck just happened. Let's walk. Rachel, the bank teller, made a very, very poor decision. Abusing her powers as a bank teller. Rachel accepted a thousand dollar bribe in exchange for an illegal service. She then proceeded to withdraw very small amounts from various dormant accounts, ultimately equaling ten thousand dollars, paying her client. Ethical or unethical? That's the question. 